Hey Lauren, let's take a look at your photo story update number one. Looks like you uh, visited with him or photographed him um, a couple different times, um, which is okay, but um, try to try to spend more time with him. All right, here we go. dark in there. All right, let's see. Let's look at your settings. So um, come down on the aperture. Um, I would shoot it with the, um, the biggest aperture, the smallest number. So that's like four or 5.6. And that would allow you um, to also well, it wouldn't allow you to do anything, but you could also come down on your shutter speed. Um, someone inside, a uh, person walking around, uh, probably 1 80th of a second. If they're not moving too fast, that should be fast enough. And so that would uh, bring your exposure under control. I know you're probably trying to balance out the screens, and um, so if that's what you're doing, then just ignore everything I said. I like this, the way this is shot. His face is just bumping in too much. Ooh, close. Needs like a little eye peeking over. These kind of work, let's see. Which one? Yeah, it's going to be a, um, a challenge photographing in here, so um, be open and willing to hang out with anything else he's doing outside of this place. It doesn't look like you would get too much uh, different shots in here anyway. You would just you know, possibly be dressed differently. This is framed nicely. like that. I, I think I like the one better that you turned in. I like the one that you turned in better. You're taking uh, a nice amount of photos, so that's good. Shooting a lot. This could maybe be fixed in Photoshop, but it, it might be t too um, overexposed. Yeah, it's, it's just uh, this black wall. His hands are getting lost in it. If it was, you know, painted white. This photo would work, but I think you turned in this one. I like it. Good detail. close, but I think we kind of need to see the top of his hands.
if if this uh, environment is was all he was going to be around, like if he wasn't leaving this room, um, I would say abandon this story just because uh, it's you know, the lighting's terrible. Uh, with him wearing a hat that you know makes the lighting even tougher um, but if it sounds like he's got enough other stuff going on where you can still pull an interesting story without having to to be in this this place too long this dungeon Was it one of those that you turned in? Yeah, one of these. Um, I don't know. Maybe this one. Uh, nice job. Hmm. That's close. Yeah, I like it. I don't know if others would. I like the one with the plant in the middle that you submitted. Maybe. Uh, he's not really doing a lot. So... to be confident that he's gonna start start doing some stuff it doesn't matter what it is um, but um, I trust you if, if you're confident um, in the story then I am confident in you um, feel free to reach out and you know ask me any questions um, that you may have Otherwise, have an awesome week.